Ladies and gentlemen, 96.4% of you are not subscribed. Make sure to subscribe and enjoy the video. Hey, what's going on ladies and gentlemen? Welcome back to another Genshin Impact video. Today guys, we're going to be talking about Noel, the free character that you can get from the game. Well, she's essentially free. You can use your acquainted fates in the beginning of the game to get her. And you get 10 or absolutely free just by playing the game. So why is Noel such a good character? for free to play players well first of all a lot of people won't think that i would say that she's an s tier character they really do not like noel and think that other characters are way better and can replace her and in some cases that is true but for free to play players do not sleep on noel why i'm saying this is because of her usage in battle she can be used as a healer and support and this is where it becomes interesting so noel's passive talent for her, for her first passive she has something called devotion. When Noel is in the party, of course she doesn't need to be in the field, she triggers an ability in which when a character falls below 30% HP, they get a shield um, equal to 400% of Noel's defense. If you guys want to build Noel, I think it'd be a really great idea to focus on defense. And she has another passive, which is called Nice and Clean, which is unlocked at Ascension number 4 in which every 4 normal or charged attack will decrease the countdown of her E ability by 1. Hitting multiple enemies with a single attack is only counted as 1 ult. And her other constellations and stuff like that will help only for her to become even better. Her second constellation decreases stamina consumption of Noel's charge attack, which means this will allow her to swing in circles for longer periods of time. And also, this will increase her damage by 15%. Fourth constellation will increase her E ability and it will defer percent of geo attack when it is destroyed. However, in her sixth constellation, which is her ultimate, which is her Q, it increases Noel's attack by 50% of her defense. So if her defense is really high, her attack is gonna be also as high. But of course, so her attack might also be even better than her defense when she's in her ultimate, which is really interesting. So for her support build, I'd recommend using a four star fight the line sword so on hit it increases the base attack and defense for maximum of six stack uh four stack sorry and what you want to use for her for her artifact is a defense defense of course we're going to use maiden beloved for that healing bonus of course characters the healing effectiveness is 15 percent for only a two set for the four set using an elemental skill or burst increases healing received by all party members by 20 percent for 10 seconds that's really good or, if you rather, you can use two of Maiden Beloved and two of the Exile, which will also help with energy recharge. But you can also use four of the Exile, which uses an elemental burst, regenerates two energy for other party members by two seconds for six seconds. This will help her with her healing as well as support. I do not recommend for her to be a DPS, although if you guys really want to, you can use the artifact Retracting Olide. But this increases her shield strength by 35%. Which is pretty good. In certain cases, this will help with the healing, but in most scenarios, it, it, it really wouldn't. But if you use a set while she's protected with the shield, she gains 40% more damage. Of course, that's for DPS. However, I do recommend using her as a support, and this will help you guys do real work with Noel. Anyways, guys, that's it for the video. Hope you guys did enjoy. If you did, hit that like button, that would be greatly appreciated. Subscribe and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.